Hi there, it's Claire from Better Meal Times. If you're a parent who's struggling to feed a fussy eater under five, then you're in the right place. And today I'm going to talk about accepting help. If you're a parent, then you might be feeling overwhelmed and confused about what to do that will change your child's fussy eating. It's completely understandable and I want you to know that I've been there. So when my twin boys were aged about two, I started looking for help with fussy eating as they had both started to behave differently with food and I was finding meal times more difficult. I was also aware of the stress that could be caused by extended fussy eating from seeing family members and friends have problems with it and I wanted to nip that in the bud and avoid it getting any worse. Ideally, I wanted to take my boys to a class that would show me what to do to reduce fussiness and help them as well and we could all move together um, move forward together towards a better experience at mealtimes. Sadly, disappointingly, what I found was that in my local area there was no help for parents other than contacting health visitors. So I did a lot of research and created my own activities, which I did with my children, and then I did those as a business with many children in my local area for several years. That led to creating a series of questions and phrases to use with children around food which I now call the Better Mealtimes Approach and I teach that to early years practitioners and parents. So backing up to accepting help, you don't have to do research, set up your own classes, test out activities with your own children and other children in order to find a way forward with your child. I would actually recommend that you avoid using Google or Facebook groups to ask questions to find a way forward as you'll just get even more overwhelmed with all those opinions. And my question to you today is what would happen if you accepted real help with your child's fussy eating? Accepting help is not an admission of failure and you're not a bad parent. And I can guarantee that if you chose to accept help from me, then you would definitely not feel worse as a result. I want to make a difference to parents who are struggling with fussy eaters by sharing the knowledge that I've built up over the, those years of work with children, with early years practitioners and with parents. And just as an example to show you what's possible, here's some great feedback that I got from a parent today. It's five days since we did our session and we were discussing her two-year-old son. So she said at the start of her email, you'll be pleased to hear that we have made good progress so far. And she then listed a detailed series of meals that had gone well and ended with this. All in all, very successful and we will keep trying, especially with the savoury food. We are so pleased already with how, easy, how, with how he is doing. So please don't think that it is impossible to change your situation. If you accept help and you take action, then you could be making good progress within days like this mum. If you would like to know how to accept help from me, then go to www.bettermealtimes.org.uk and check out what's available. Please share this with anyone you think might also be interested in accepting help. And I look forward to helping you all towards better mealtimes. Thanks for watching and take care.